All right, Chef Dan here. We're gonna do farmer's mashed potatoes. They're so delicious. The first thing you need to do is go shopping for the potatoes. Since you're gonna do a mashed potatoes, it doesn't have to be the right, correct sizes, stuff like that. You can get a mixed match of different types of size. So here's the red potatoes that you're gonna go look for when you go into the market. All right, so I'm simply just gonna dice these up. I'm gonna put them into some boiling water with a little pinch of salt, and then you know what? I'll come back and strain them and we'll see you then. Welcome back, our potatoes are done. All I have to do now is just scoop them out with a spoon here. Okay, and I'm gonna put them right in the strainer here so the water goes into this little bowl. Because we wanna try to get all the water out as much as possible. But I'm just gonna use one of these potato mashers, right? Because they come in handy. So I'm just gonna mash it. I use skin and all. So I'm just gonna add some little bit of regular whole milk inside. This gives a little bit of fluffiness to the potato when you do that, okay? So I'm just going to whip that up real good. And then at this point, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add my seasoning mix, okay? And my little bit of butter. So here I have some cube butter. I just use unsalted butter because you wanna not add a lot of salt, a lot of sugar. You wanna keep it as healthy as possible. So I'm gonna add like maybe three or four cubes of the butter right into my mashed potato mix. And I'm just gonna continue to whip those around. It may need more milk, but I see the butter is melting pretty good there, which is great. And you could see the skin there, but that's okay. You know, this, it's not going to hurt you. Like I said, the skin acts like a real nice um, a garnish that's inside of your potato. And they're, like I said, they're really healthy. If you want to peel them, you can. I don't. I just leave them, you know, right inside. Well, thanks for watching. Hey, click the like button and subscribe to us button, and we'll see you next time.